Hi everyone, welcome to Reader's World. Today I'll be reading the book Big Red Barn by Margaret Weiss Brown. Pictures by Felicia Bond. By the big red barn in the great green field, there was a pink pig who was learning to squeal. There was a great big horse and a very little horse. And on every barn is a weather vane, of course, a golden flying horse. There was a big pile of hay and a little pile of hay. And that is where the children play. But in the story, the children are away. Only the animals are here today. The sheep and the donkey, the geese and the goats were making funny noises down in their throats. An old scarecrow was leaning on his hoe and a field mouse was born in a field of corn. Cock-a-doodle-doo! In the barn there was a rooster and a pigeon too and a big white hen standing on one leg and under the hen was a quiet egg. There was a bantam rooster and a little bantam hen with a big clutch of eggs. Count them, there are ten. Cock-a-doodle-doo! Moo! Moo! There was a big brown cow and a little brown cow. There was an old black cat, meow, meow, and a tiger tomcat, yow, yow. There was a big red dog, bow, wow, with some little puppy dogs all round and warm. And they all lived together in the big red barn, and they played all day in the grass and in the hay. When the sun went down in the great green field, the big cow lowed, the little pig squealed. The horses stomped in the sweet warm hay, and the little donkey gave one last bray. The hens were sleeping on their nest, even the roosters took a rest. The little black bats flew away out of the barn at the end of the day. And there they were all night long sound asleep in the big red barn. Only the mice were left to play, rustling and squeaking in the hay, while the moon sailed high in the dark night sky. The end. If you like this story, please do give a thumbs up and subscribe for more stories. Have an awesome day.